When you're estimating projects using Red Rhino assemblies, it's important to understand what's in one assembly. So I recommend you just go in there, what I like to call noodle around, and just go in there and input one of these and one of those, and then look at the materials over here and see what's included in one assembly. But after you get used to doing that then, you, you, actually, you actually hit a fast pace when you're estimating these projects. You go in and write down how many 20 amp receptacles, 15 amp receptacles, quad receptacles, fixtures, smoke alarms, etc. And then you come in here and input them. Now, I'm going to, just as an example, I'm going to say I'm, I'm bidding a job here and there's really a total of 8 20 amp receptacles and 2 quads. So I'll type in quantity 2 here. See how I'm going through this list? I look at them. Let's say that there's one 20 amp GFI weatherproof. I'll put in a quantity of one of these. This is how you hit a pace of really inputting fast um, materials into Red Rhino. You just go down the list like a laundry list and you fill it out. Okay, This is after you've done your material takeoff. So I'm going to say that there's several 15 amp duplex receptacles. I'm going to say that there's 22 of them. Now, Next, it lists your switches, residential 1-gang, 15-amp switch, 2-gang, 3-gang, 4-gang. You just go in here and type in the respective amounts of switches, okay? And when you're all done with all these, you scroll up to the top, you click Add. When you do, Red Rhino populates all the materials for those assemblies, all of them at one time. Now you click Save to save your work. Something else I want to tell you is I highly recommend that every time you make an entry, you go back and check every single line of materials. So go back and check every single line. Look at, look at how many hours there are for drilling holes, how many, for, uh, how many hours for uh, installing the 12-2 Romex, etc. Always check every entry.